It was three years ago that we first heard about the Clio, a robust, donut-shaped prototype drone made by Clio Robotics. Well, its successor is now commercially available, under the new name of the Dronaut X1. While drones are becoming more mainstream, most companies have coalesced around the same design. As DJI's recent efforts have shown, such as the Mavic 3 and Mavic 3 Cine, consumer drones rely on four propellers to keep them airborne. However, these propellers make drones not ideal for use indoors or in tight spaces where they could face multiple obstacles at once. In response, Clio Robotics has developed the Dronaut X1, which lacks external propellers. Accordingly, the drone contains cutouts vents for displaced air to escape. Clio Robotics has equipped the Dronaut X1 with an unnamed Qualcomm Snapdragon SOC and numerous sensors. The drone also has a LiDAR scanner for improved navigation, along with LED lights that serve as headlights. The Dronaut X1 has a 1km range and a built-in 4K camera for capturing video or photos, too. The Dronaut X1 weighs 425 grams and is intended for use in industry rather than at home. Correspondingly, Clio Robotics has priced the Dronaut X1 at $9,800. We profiled Clio Robotics, and its innovative drone technology, back in 2019. Now the Boston-based startup and mass robotics resident is commercially shipping its Dronaut X1 drone, $9,800, designed for law enforcement, industrial inspection, construction, and defense applications. The key to the drone is Clio's patented thrust vectoring technology that enables the ducted fan design to remain stable during flight. To overcome efficiency problems, the drone uses counter-rotating propellers on top of each other, surrounded by an enclosure. And because the propellers are enclosed, Clio claims this enables the drone to bounce off objects and people safely. The Dronaut X1 is designed for unmanned inspection of GPS-denied environments such as tanks, pressure vessels, crawl spaces, and more. It can also be used, Clio said, by law enforcement involved in high-risk situations or as a flying surveillance camera for facility security. The Dronaut X1 uses LiDAR for obstacle detection and a sensor suite for image and data collection with HD video slash pictures and 3D point cloud output. Clio said the latency on gathering video data is under 90 milliseconds. The Dronaut X1 shell is made out of carbon fiber, and the drone weighs 15 ounces and measures 5.5 inches in diameter. However, it has a flight time of just 12 minutes, and it takes 40 minutes to recharge the battery. Built to solve what had been thought of as unsolvable technical challenges with ducted fan aerial vehicles, we developed and tested the Dronaut platform through rigorous and innovative engineering. We are excited to see the impact that the Dronaut X1 will have on the industries that it is designed to serve, said Omar Alarian, founder and CEO, Clio Robotics. Like its predecessor, the Donut X1 features just two counter-rotating rotors stacked one above the other. While we have seen other drones that take this approach, Clio Robotics goes the extra step of enclosing those rotors within a composite ducted body. This means that they can't harm bystanders, nor can they be harmed when bumping into obstacles such as walls. According to the company, the X1 is designed for applications such as inspection and reconnaissance within cramped and GPS-denied environments. It's Wi-Fi controlled via a joystick remote and an Android app, although it can autonomously hold its position, and it can avoid obstacles with some help from an onboard 3D LiDAR sensor. Steering is managed through a proprietary. The X1 also streams real-time 1080p 30fps video to its user, plus it shoots and records 4K footage, with four LED spotlights providing illumination. One 40-minute charge of its removable lithium battery ought to be suitable for a flight time of 12 minutes. Should you be interested in getting one for yourself, or, more likely, your business, the Dronaut X1 is available now for $9,800. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you like the video, you must press the like and subscribe button. And let us know your valuable feedback by commenting below the video.